Okay, we're here at 9935 Toluca Lake Avenue or Drive here in Toluca Lake. And we're here to check the main sewer line. <coughs> we obviously cannot check every pipe in the house, that you'll have your general inspector crawl underneath the house. He'll physically look at everything. We're here to check the main line, and this inspection is based on my opinion. So I can tell you that we are started off by running the camera from a two-inch clean-out located here in the little crawl space uh, of the house. We've actually found a main line clean-out once we've come outside, ran the camera, and we'll continue our inspection from. Basically, we have our camera in the line. We're all the way out to the city connection in the street, and we cannot get our camera past this little spot over here. So we cannot check the, the actual city connection. Hopefully, uh, we're actually running the camera from a two-inch clean-out. So hopefully from the four-inch clean-out outside, we'll be able to have a better shot at getting past this point over here where we cannot get our camera. To. So just bring the camera back a little bit. Come back. Come back. Oh, it's kind of badly shifted over here. Come back. Looks like there might be roots right at the end there, you see. Yeah. And it's kind of badly shifted right at the city connection. All right, so bring the camera back here. It looks like there's a cured in place pipe lining over here. I'm not sure. I'll just have to look at this real good because it could be a very thin lining. Mm. I think they're definitely aligning that over here. So we're going to bring the camera back. I mean, this all looks okay, that's my opinion, but right at the end there, it's definitely very badly dislocated. Yeah, this is definitely a cured in place pipe lining. Now, one thing for certain that if you ever do have a blockage or something, you should never run a cable with a blade through a lining because you can damage it. Uh, it always has to be cleaned with a hydro jetter very carefully. As it comes onto the property, changes to a 4-inch ABS plastic pipe here. Now, this is all ABS plastic coming back from here. Whatever we could check underneath the house and outside to the property lines, all ABS plastic in good condition. But I'm a little skeptical about the connection to the city. And it appears to be probably like 15 or 16 feet deep in the street. And that's very deep. Stop over there. Go forward a little bit. Go forward. Let me just locate this, because there might be another clean-out over here. We'll check that out. Okay, so that's the clean-out that we'll continue our inspection from. That's where the pipe exits the house over here. And now we're coming underneath the house. This is right underneath the electrical meter box, just for your information. So we're going to keep coming. That's all ABS plastic underneath the house, whatever we're able to check. This is all in good condition. We always recommend never to flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. Okay, so here it comes out of the clean out over here from under the house. We're going to pause the recording. Okay, so we're running the camera from the four inch clean out located here where the pipe exits the house. We're right at the city connection. The street's about 15 feet deep. Uh, and um, we can see over here, it looks like there's roots getting into the end of the pipe over here. And basically, I don't know, it's difficult to say, it also looks like it's either slightly broken or very badly dislocated. And we cannot jump over that. 
So something's definitely going on here right at the city connection. We cannot check this. It looks like there's roots and stuff over there. Bring the camera back very slowly. Stop, stop. Yep, hold on. Oh, you can see it's very heavy roots there. Right at the end of the line. Okay, bring the camera back. So these linings, they, they don't really stop roots from growing. And um, so technically there, that is a problem right at the city connection. This lining over here doesn't appear to be an approved lining anyway. It looks like a very thin lining. Not sure that these, whoever did this lining got a, a public works permit for this. A public works inspector would never approve something like that at this time. Okay, when you come onto the property, keep coming. Okay, stop. I'm going to locate here. Okay, so I've located that just about a foot underneath the sidewalk over here. Obviously, they extended the four-inch pipe a little bit into the public right away. Coming back from here, it's all ABS plastic. It's all in good condition over here. So everything looks pretty good here except the city connection over there and the lining that you have over here. So that can be a problem over there. We're going to bring the camera back. It's also very deep in the street. As it comes out of the clean-out over here, underneath the electrical meter over here, 